other TV. I'm not ready for you, baby. I'm not ready for you. <laughs> All right, whenever you're ready. Color TV. The lights are on. The camera set. My reality is on broadcast. The screens are blare. The imagery of my flaws I protest. I cover my eyes with caution signs that dissolve away with acidic banter. And yet, I stay. The object of the headline. Blasting out in disgust, labeling me killer. Never laid a finger on it. But they can't see past the color TV that influences their verdict. She stands like a saint with honey blonde curls and black lies rolling away from her made up eyes. They crowd around in silence. All she did was point a finger and hick. It's he who done it. He who stood at her doorstep each night at her call. He who smiled, she would return shyly as he pressed his palm to her. He who saw her press the gun to her head to blow away the defamation. Can't be a queen with a black man at your side. The same black man who rocked her to sleep in his arms, breathing in the scent of that blonde southern beauty, his forbidden fruit. He awoke the next morning to police wails and a bell screams, shouting murderer, betrayal and buried, lower than nurture. Outraged cries and blood red eyes, but the back is never seen on this. I stand silently as handcuffs glide like water over my skin, eyes still straight till she looks away, afraid to face her outcome. The judge stares down, I walk to a doorstep, and she won't let me in. Are there any last words? I turn to my people who yell and scream justice, I smile with it, and raise my arms. We'll have ours, on clouds of snow and a golden gate to greet us. And love will fairly embrace our worn fingers from years of picking textiles. Love will openly face us without nylon necklaces and stainless steel cat scans. Then we will stand like kings next to those murdered by these color TVs. And we will stand free. Blackness. I suck in a thick cotton cloth I labored hot days to create my death sentence. They yell murderer and point fingers saying we should have known the nigga. I smile under cotton feeling a little too much like silk. Knowing I will have mine where the lines behind black and white divide, this is not my crime. But I take it. For the years of sinners unpunished, I serve this sentence. To rid the grief of my sisters who lost their purity to your games. To rid the grief of my brother's quick luck gone like they never existed. And while we scream for your law and order, you whimpered that it wasn't your problem. Mm -hmm. I take the years of our pain and suffer for the cause. Because I'm only one man. But my life will cause static with this broadcast. The first law in its televised civil justice, I stand. Handcuffed to your demands, covered with a cloth meant to show how you see me. Black as night, thin as water, but my presence is known here. And it will grow. Of the black box in every living room. Of the black speakers in every restaurant. Okay, honey, sit down now.